Hispanic Heritage Month, and a new report finds that Hispanic buying power is growing, with much of it concentrated in eight states, including New York and New Jersey. In fact, one business that sells items unique to Mexican culture is on the verge of a major expansion. CBS 2's Lisa Rosner reports from Passaic County. These are made of ceramic and hand painted. Colorful creations made with love from Mexico. From handmade tortilla keepers to original stone mocajetes used for salsa to folklore gnomes. Literally anything you've ever thought of or not thought of to be associated with life in Mexico can be found in La Providencia on First Street in Passaic, New Jersey. What we do is we import tradition and we sell culture. This is what we do. We've been doing it for 16 years. Co founder Lilia Rios says, 80% of what you see inside is made in Mexico. Just take a look around the the birds, everything's it's beautiful. Lilia's husband was studying international business and saw there was a niche for Mexicans living abroad. Products uh, we never find in another place. Products like Mexican candies and religious items like hand-painted statues of the Lady of Guadalupe, a powerful symbol of Mexican faith. And in the basement, <laughs> Estrella or star pinatas, traditionally featuring seven cones in a star formation, being made from scratch. The store also sells traditional palitos or sticks used to destroy a pinata. We're going to find out what's inside this one. Or we're not. Yeah, it wasn't as easy as it looks. Okay, we're almost there. A couple tries later. Can you do it? Let's see. And now it's my turn. It's candy. <laughs> but in Mexico, it can also be filled with fruits or nuts. Fun and games aside, a new study from the Bank of America finds the total economic input of Latinos in the U.S. is upwards of $2.6 trillion, one of the fastest growing in the world. Carlos Medina is with the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce of New Jersey. It's an untapped market for many corporations. Lilia says people come in just to tour her vibrant store. She says the colors represent the happiness of people living in Mexico, and she takes pride in sharing that with others. In Passaic, New Jersey, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. Okay, it's harder than it looks. Mm -hmm. Lily Rio says in the next two years, they are planning to open five new locations. They're off to a great start. I think they need a bigger stick. <laughs> right? That's right, a bigger boat. A bat. Yeah. <laughs> Get that thing open.